everyone, it's you, me. If that's your first time here, thank you for coming by. If it's your second time or more, thank you for coming back. I'm used to saying these things. <laughs> but anyway, in Japan, there is a traditional food we have for breakfast. It's natto. Do you know what natto is? It's fermented soybeans and then we can have it every day but I think some people have it every day for their health usually if we live with the families and stuff we have it at least once a month natto is very healthy it's it's soybeans so obviously uh, protein a lot of protein and you I think you know tofu that's made from soybeans so natto is the other way some of them become tofu some of them become natto some of them become edamame so beans are healthy I don't like beans but I just like natto I don't know why I eat only edamame and natto today I am going to introduce what natto is Okay, let's start! So, I brought natto here. Ding! This is natto. This is not the particular regular natto. I got these from my mom. These are, I think, little good ones. Good natto. I'm going to eat it. There is 30 grams of soybeans in one pack. And it's only 47 kilocalories. Then I realized how big that was the yakisoba noodles that I had the other day. <laughs> I can't open it, so I'm just gonna cut it open. It says extremely small natto. The kanji is for extreme, but it doesn't mean really extreme. It just says the small natto. They have the medium size, they have the bigger size. I like medium. Small is like very small. Medium is always good. Big one is more, it tastes more like soybeans. And like I said, I don't really like soybeans. So if you like beans, then I think you like the bigger ones. But if you don't like beans, then try medium or small. This is very small. This is very small. Usually, natto comes in a cup or packet like this. And inside, there is a sauce. And oh no, mustard. Usually, it comes with the karashi mustard, the Japanese mustard. This is natto. Usually, it comes with karashi mustard, but this doesn't. This is the natto sauce, natto no tare. With no chemicals. The tare has soy sauce, sugar, salt, bonito, seaweed, and yeast. Okay, let's eat. Because it's sticky, it usually has a wrapper like this. Oh, it looks gross, huh? <laughs> I know, I understand. Okay. I don't want my chopsticks, my regular chopsticks to be really sticky. So I usually use not eco-friendly chopsticks. Sorry. Or spin. Okay. And usually we put mustard and sauce here, like this. And stare. Stare a lot. Stare. Some people say the more you stare, the better the taste is but some people say just 10 to the right and 10 to the left so I'm not sure I just stare until I think it's good and I don't know what's good it gets stickier and stickier stare 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 until it's good Okay, I think it's good. Let's eat. 
we uh, most of Japanese put natto over freshly steamed rice but when I went to the US and I was babysitting a half Japanese kid she was eating natto right from the container and then it was actually good so since then I started eating natto just with natto <laughs> this one is actually um, not too salty and it's good. It tastes the beans. I can taste the beans more. Beans itself are full of protein, but the sauce, the tarot, actually has sugar, so be careful with that. So I don't usually put the whole packet of tarot, I just put a little bit to have a flavor. When I was a kid, natto smelled so bad. It smelled really like something rotten, but these days, natto has gotten better and it actually doesn't taste much of anything but it's really good for your health though so if you want to try that it's cheap too maybe not these but the regular natto is only a dollar for three packets or something so that's why we usually have it for breakfast for the light breakfast It's good, but my mouth is all messy. So you really need what tissue for this? Mm, my lipstick is gone. So, how did you think natto was? Did you want to try it or no? <laughs> I understand. It looks gross. I understand. I admit it looks gross. If it wasn't Japanese, I wouldn't eat it maybe or I would try but I would be like, what are you eating? But trust me, it's good. If you like healthy food, if you like healthier food, then I think you'll like it because it's just the looks. It's unique. That's why it's different. <laughs> But it's actually really good. So if you are going to Japanese market or they even have that at Chinese or Korean market, right? Try natto and be healthier with me, okay? Thank you for watching. I'll see you in my next episode. Bye.